Once the rush of our teenage years is over, do our brains stop changing? Is who we are fixed in stone once we reach adulthood? Well, it's true that most of the dramatic shifts in brain structure are done by our early 20s. And for a long time, researchers thought that was that. But I've come to London to look at a pioneering study that reveals how even in adulthood, our brains can undergo radical physical changes. Study the knowledge is 640 quarter mile radius areas. 24,000 streets and roads that need to be learnt, 50,000 places of interest. What is known as the knowledge is a test of recall of all the streets in London. The driver of every black cab has to pass it to get a license. Bayswater Road for Marble Arch, right part lane, left right part corner, bear right juke when place, left right corner. It's one of the world's most difficult feats of memory. And completing it usually takes over four years of intensive study. People will spend three to four hours a day reciting pretend journeys. That starts to make them see it, is the term we use, how to get around London. The unique mental challenge of passing the knowledge made it of particular interest to a group of neuroscientists. They began doing brain scans of the drivers before, during, and after the rigorous training. They were interested in an area of the brain called the posterior hippocampus. It underpins spatial memory. At the beginning, it looked just like everyone else's, but by the end of the training, it had grown physically larger. All the map memorizing, all the driving, all the simulation of future routes, this reshaped their brain anatomy to match the task at hand. The longer a cabbie had been doing his job, the bigger the change in that brain region. Even when we're adults, our brains can still change. 